All right, before we begin, I just want to say what's up. Welcome back to more Resident Evil 4 Remake. All the support on the 29 videos I did for the main story, the one demo video, and the four mercenary videos uh, mean a lot to me. So, we're going to try out the hand cannon fully maxed out. I'm not sure what else I'll do after this. This might be it for now on the uh, Resident Evil 4 stuff. I'm hoping they have more, I guess, mercenary characters. Maybe extra DLC down the road. I like the Rose DLC for Resident Evil Village, but it was pretty far after. So we'll kind of see how it goes. But anyways, love you all. Best audience ever. If you enjoyed these Resident Evil 4 videos and you have any ideas for other ones I could do for it, just let me know in the comments below. But anyways, love you all. Thanks for like support. Let's go ahead and get this. And here we are. Chapter 2 on Professional. Just after you get Leon's weapons back, I bought... There was like a five-pack of these exclusive upgrade tickets. I wasn't going to spend money, but I was like, for the video sake, I'll... At least do this. I may upgrade other guns as well. It's like the best deal. Uh, but I didn't realize you could sell them for 80000 So you could essentially swap out one of these for the first rocket launcher. I think the price goes up after the, each one. I'm not really sure. But anyways, here it is. Fully Welcome. maxed out. Ooh, what you buying? Exclusive gives it infinite ammo, essentially. You have a ticket, do you? Nice. Choose a weapon, stranger, and I'll make it sing. I was hoping he would say Kila Man one more time, but all right, here we go. First time using Next this. Time, buy something, eh? I've shot it when it wasn't fully maxed out, but uh, I wanted to try it on these like there's like a little section of enemies right here, and there's like a chainsaw oh, yeah. guy at the very end. I want to you know try it against. So we'll see. Oh my goodness! Now it does have a reload animation, but I can't reload it obviously. So. Same for the Chicago type part. I think they have like a little like pose he does. All right. Been playing so much mercenaries, like professional, the enemies would be a little more difficult. But it, you know, obviously we got infinite ammo and the fully maxed out best weapon. The accuracy on this thing is not the best. We're going to just try it though. Oh, double kill! Let's go. Let's get it. Might just stay over here. There's so many enemies around here. It's actually crazy. If I was a plant like I'm actually gonna play it. So. Oh god. That's that's bad news. Got some body armor at least. Back up! All professional is crazy. You have, you do have to like perfect parry everything. My least favorite enemy was that one. I don't know why those enemies, where they try to like stab you. And they kind of run low, so you kind of have to aim down a little bit. How you doing? Is it safe to even do this yet? I see more. Okay, let's just go ahead and do it. I'm gonna get I'm gonna get attacked right when it Here it goes. Okay, we're good. Oh, come on. How you doing? I remember the original game had, like, this section was a little bit different. What I was in shooting my leg. Well, that takes care of that. Get hop down. I'm gonna go this way. Shot his arm clean off. This thing is crazy. I was going to start from the very beginning of the game and try this out, but you can't, so... You need the merchant to upgrade. Which pretty much negates any kind of, uh... Oh, wait. Can you not go through there? Oh, that's right. You got to go through the window. I wasn't in here long. But yeah, so I basically kind of did like a little speed run through chapter one. I've, I got it done in like 13 minutes or something. But I also stopped and collected stuff and I did like the five, uh, five little token things. Let me just hop down. Hello? Oh my. Oh my. Oh 
They were all just waiting for me. I love it. Mm, I could search everything. I'm not gonna really like, worry about everything. More enemies are showing up, so. See you later! Go ahead and take this. Make more enemies pop up now that I <laughs> that I took that. The bloom on the actual hand cannon is insane. Wasn't expecting that. Playing the mercenaries though, like when I was playing, I was like, man, this would be such a good engine. If they if they like use the exact same setup for RE5, the mercenaries on there I used to play all the time. I was back on the Xbox 360 days. I guess I could collect everything. I'm really not going to save the save files, so I'm just... Hold on, there's one other enemy up top. No, there's two, I think. i go around and get them really quick. But I remember, like, in 5, you play as, like, Wesker, you had Sheva. Everybody had, like, their own, like, kit. And uh, it's cool that they kind of brought that. Well, I mean, granted, RE4 had the Mercenaries first. But I think RE3 on PS1 also had it. So I don't really know who did it first. Oh, are these enemies coming up here to me. How you doing, sir? Best. It's insane to me that every... Hold on. Every shot basically, like, takes a limb off, <laughs> you know? I mean, it's supposed to, I guess. But... What in the world? First run over here to the right, I think. Yeah, yeah. I hear somebody else talking. I think we're good. That's the accuracy. Right in the middle. There he goes. Anything over here? No. I've been playing this like I played Village for a while, where after I finished it, I just sort of like, I wanted to just kind of keep playing it, you know? But yeah, I wanted to show this off, you know, kind of one little bonus video before I probably take a break from the game. Um, I've heard they got four of the characters from Mercenaries potentially coming, but I don't know. Maybe like Ada? That would be cool. Oh yeah, the, uh, puzzle. Let me rotate now, I think? Hold on. I think this should do it. Yeah, there we go. I didn't know if on Professional the puzzles were different or, or what. I think some of them might be, but I won't know until I practice. And I think there's a chainsaw guy... I guess he's like the doctor of the village. From what I read online. Oh, cut in half. I haven't seen that yet. Something has been bugging me. Oh, hold on. It's been bugging me. Is can you use a knife on these? Okay, you can. It's good to know. I've never seen him like I think in my entire series, they've never stepped on a bear trap until this moment. Alright. There we go. Highly unnecessary, but whatever. That actually worked too. Oh yeah, let me get this. I forgot chapter two is actually pretty short. Here we go. Okay, I wanna see, I don't know if I can get one shot and just see how it goes. Get closer, come on. Okay, he doesn't one shot. Two shot though. What the? Ooh. Okay. Well, I just I like how it was point blank, and it just didn't matter. Lateral. There we go. Yeah, I think we basically run through here. Yeah, chapter one is pretty short. Now that I think about it, chapter two is also pretty linear. You know. Because you can't go through there, you go around the back, and then you go up here, that's when you run into Mendez for the first time. But, I guess I'll get to the typewriter in the house, and then stop. Okay. Okay, game. One last bear trap. I got you. I asked, I don't know, is this... 
Is this hand cannon usable in mercenaries? Like, who would even use it? Oh, yeah, there's an enemy in here. There you go. Uh, little puzzles over there, but I'm just gonna go up here and just, like, stop here. I wanted to show you the other outfits, too, so... I'm not gonna save it, so I think I just quit out. There we go. Somebody also asked to see this, so... Essentially, main story, just go to extras. Here's all the different ones. Now, I don't know, like, I got some of these through the pre-order stuff, the deluxe things. I don't know. I think Penstripe is probably my favorite. The heroine seems like they don't really do anything. This one looks cool. Reminds me of Devil May Cry a lot. <laughs> if it is from Devil May Cry, I can't remember, but... Uh, Leon accessories, I don't have one thing. She had a couple of different outfits I thought was kind of cool. The casual, which doesn't really seem casual. Romantic, I thought it was like a vampire type thing. So, and then the original soundtrack. Filter's kind of weird. I don't like that one or this one. Anyways, that's it for now. Thank you so much all the support on these extra videos. I've kind of just been uh, enjoying my time with it. I had a lot of fun. The mercenary thing kind of caught me off guard because I wasn't expecting it to drop when it did. And then when, once the hand cannon thing was able to be unlocked, I was like, this is perfect. I can also show that off. So anyways, that's it. Love you all. I'll talk to you on the flip side. Peace.